Hey, what's up everyone? I'm here to do an unboxing of two new games that just came out today. One of them is not really an uh, unboxing because it's already unboxed and I got it. I rented it from Blockbuster, but because Blockbuster does this thing where they actually just give you the case now uh, and it's new, I'm just going to unbox it anyway. You know, sure, more views, you could say that. Whatever, I like views. What, you got a problem? Uh, you got a problem? Come at me, bro. Uh, anyway. Yeah, some Jersey Shore shit. What's up? Uh, anyway, let me unbox the one that's actually uh, you know, a box where I have to unbox it. You know, where I unwrap it and then I unbox it. Uh, the first one is, of course, a game I couldn't wait for. It's probably my most anticipated game of the next, like, the first few months of the year. And that is Bullet Storm, of course. This is the Epic Edition, so it comes with the. The Gears of War beta, the Gears of War 3 beta uh, invitation, and a whole bunch of other extra stuff. I think it comes with like a, uh, wait, oh, it says right here, Epic Edition includes additional content and multiplayer experience point, okay, <laughs> it comes with a whole bunch of other stuff, thanks, that explained a lot. Uh, so, yeah, let's open this one, this is the Epic Edition, let me show you one more time, that's the front, that's the back, and that's the side, so got this from Amazon so I also got a $20 Amazon gift card thing they, that they do where you when you get them get it from them uh, and it was also a little cheaper it was like a couple dollars cheaper too so and also I get it the same day it comes out so I don't need to go anywhere so that's why I love Amazon Ooh, shit. that's why I always recommend people to buy shit from Amazon uh, at least new games movies not so much because they don't really do release date shipping and their prices are Probably pretty much the same as like Best Buy or Blockbuster or whatever. All right, so let's open it. Let me take the sticker off. These these things right here. Stickers are closing. All right, so uh, it's fucking plastic off. All right, uh, let's open it. And the first thing you notice is that it is a eco case, and it comes with my online pass because EA does that all the time now. So I'm not gonna show you that, but you know, yeah. Here, uh, I'll cover most of it. There you go. That's an online pass, and uh, oh, also comes with, also comes with the epic uh, content, like it says there. Uh, this is also a advertisement for Dragon Age 2 and Dead Space 2, two games that, uh, one game already came out and another is about to come out. Uh, here's the manual for Bulletstorm. It's not the epic edition of the manual, and also it's very cheap light. It's just black and white, uh, and it has the obviously regular case to it. Uh, and that's the case there. Let me put it all back in there and show you what it looks like with all of it in there. To make sure it covers this code, though. Do it again. There you go. Uh, and the disc and there you go that's what it looks like inside no no back art is the bottom I mean the back there's no back art like for the cover so you don't see any art there like PS3 games do which I'm gonna unbox a PS3 game in a minute obviously everybody knows what it is uh, but anyway there's Bolt Storm can't wait to play that go play that first probably uh, probably gonna have a review for it tomorrow and the next game I have is a game I rented from Blockbuster, but because they do their cases so well, let me get rid of the receipt, let me get rid of the, you know, Blockbuster does the boxes so well, as in, and when I mean they do it so well, I mean they pretty much uh, keep everything that came in the box, so all the exclu exclusive content and stuff. Uh, and they just give you the whole box. So here you go. I rented this from Blockbuster. Here's the even the sleeve that comes with the game when you rent it from Blockbuster. And it is Killzone 3, of course. Everybody knows, but yeah, whatever. Look, it looks like a, a real just regular case. Look, no no stickers on it or anything. So here you go. There's the front. There is the back. And that's the side. I will be playing this with the PS Move. So if I review this, I'll review the PS Move compatibility with it. I played the beta. Like the beta, pretty good. It was sad because I actually did better with the PS Move controller than I did with a regular controller. So hopefully that's not the case with the full game. Hopefully it was just the people I was playing with that sucked. Uh, so anyway, first thing I noticed when I opened this, I was like, what will we will? Because I didn't read the case because I didn't really care. Uh, SOCOM 4 beta. 
And from what I read on the back, uh, you can even check the back. It doesn't have the code. You have to scratch it off. So uh, it says you could just redeem it right now and play the beta, it looks like. It doesn't say it's not released yet. So that's pretty cool. I could play the uh, SOCOM 4 beta right now, I'm, I'm guessing. So that's pretty cool. Uh, first thing you notice is that PS3, I like PS3 cases not because of the actual cases like this you know I don't really like the clear case I like them because they always present it so well and you know the back art of course they have back art for most PS3 games mostly just exclusives but uh and also no eco cases there's sometimes where they do eco cases but you know nice art right there with the main characters of Killzone there's the disc of Killzone and here's the manual and I'm guessing it's gonna be in color no, it's actually not. Oh, never mind. It's not in color. Let me show you. Oh, there's some parts where it's colored, but most of it's black and white. Most of it's black and white. So, uh, there you go. There's the case. There's the unboxing for Killzone 3 or 2 or 1. From what I played, there's no big difference. So, I know I'm going to get <laughs> slack for that. But, you know, I guess I could say the same thing for Halo or... Halo, uh, or Call of Duty. Yeah, I can say the same for all that kind of stuff. So, uh, I can't, because I think there's differences, but Killzone 1 and 2, I mean, besides graphics, they felt like the same game. Not saying they're bad any or anything, just, I don't know. And playing the beta of Killzone 3 didn't feel like there was a big difference, even though I barely played the multiplayer of Killzone 2. Felt like the same thing, though, you know. Whatever. Anyway, there you go, there's boxings of two games, one game I don't actually own, but... Well, unbox it anyway, why not? People might want to know what comes with it, and I didn't know. It comes with a SOCOM 4 beta. Look at that. So there you go. There's unboxing for Killzone 3 and Bulletstorm Epic Edition. Uh, there you go. Thank you, and goodbye.